Hello, I'm Claire Gray, Disability Advocacy Advisor at Shore Trust. I have a number of adjustments in my work to enable me to do my role. These uh, include a support worker who helps me with all the physical aspects of my job. So that includes helping me to take notes, give and receive handouts to assist with any training that I might be doing or delivering. Um, but also, most importantly, to help me with my transport needs. So that might be with um, using public transport or you driving my own vehicle to and from the different venues that I need to go to. In terms of assistive technology, I also have Dragon software, which means that I can speak to my computer and it types up what I'm saying. So this helps me in many ways helps me to respond to emails and reports, um, different consultations that I need to have input into and helps me um, feel generally less tired from having to type because actually I can speak much quicker than I can type. Um, and also I have my wheelchair which um, not only enables me to get around but also has other features on it which enable me to hire or lower the seating on the chair. So this is really important when I'm out and about, especially at networking and meetings, because then I can be an equal height to everybody else. So all in all, my adjustments enable me to do my job. If I didn't have them, I wouldn't be able to do the varied aspects of my job or, or my job at all. So for me, they work really well. My name's Gemma and I'm Industrial Content Officer at Shore Trust. So I have dyslexia. What dyslexia means to me is um, it's a lot harder for me to spell things um, and I find it quite hard in terms of timing to get things right. So I often um, have like meetings with my manager to prioritise my workload. So the reasonable workplace adjustments I have are um, someone to proofread my work and also someone to go through my weekly prioritizations with me and also specialist software, which is contextual grammar checking software. So um, before I came to Shore Trust, my life was a lot different. So I worked in journalism where people are expected to, to spell things correctly. So when you come into it from the perspective of a, dy of a dyslexic writer, it's quite you know, hard to get ahead because people can only see the mistakes in your work unless you explain to them that you're dyslexic. And then often they get quite confused about what that means and you have to explain it fully to them for them to understand. So I would say don't be afraid to disclose your dyslexia in the workplace because there are some good people out there and they will understand if you explain to them in a positive way that it's not just, you know, spelling mistake. There's, you know, lots of really good things about dyslexia. You're more creative and you're really good at problem solving. So there's lots of brilliant points about your condition, whatever, whatever it is. Hi, my name is Sean. I work for Shore Trust as an inclusive employment consultant. My role is to support employers to be disability confident. I contracted polio as an infant and this has led to using two elbow crutches to aid walking and I've also been diagnosed with flaccid paralysis of my lower limbs. Over the years this has resulted into muscle pains, arthritis. Short Trust use one of the interventions like access to work to fund a special chair as a back support for me to sit comfortably in the office without suffering with pains and aches and this has eliminated uh, tiredness and improved my productivity. Also, working in a flexible and inclusive manner with my team and the line manager has supported me as well to be productive in my role. For example, I use tools like WebEx to communicate with my colleagues and also other online tools to source vacancies and communicate with employers 
have really cut travel time and again reduced pains and aches within the scope of the work I'm doing. I have access to a packing bay in the office, so I don't have to worry about rushing around or finding a place to pack when I arrive, when I arrive at work. I am confident that these interventions and ongoing support at Short Trust will continue to help me retain and sustain my employment. Thank you.